Good morning guys, we're back. Welcome back to the Perkins household. I don't know about you guys, if you guys have missed us, but we have definitely missed you guys. We haven't vlogged in about a week. I'm gonna be honest, I missed the vlog. I missed vlogging, I missed hanging out with you guys. So I'm really excited to be back. This week has been amazing though. Our daughter, she is the biggest blessing. She is such a little sweetheart. She's so cute. You guys have finally met her. You know how beautiful she is. In the last week, she has changed so much though, guys. It's amazing how quickly babies change. She's such a blessing. She's a good sleeper, aside, aside from, from from last night, Nikki and I are a little bit tired today, but it's all good. We're about to head out and do a newborn photo shoot with our friend, Kristen Cook, who is one of the best baby photographers in Australia. She's incredible. She did Ava's newborn photos. She's done some other photo shoots with Ava and her photos are amazing and she's, She's a baby whisperer. That's the only way that I can describe this lady. She is just so warm and sweet and she just knows how to make babies and parents just feel incredibly comfortable. Hey guys, so this is one week since Zoe was born, so she's she turned one week last night at 11 45. It's gone so quick. I know. This whole when week you said it last so night, I was just like, no, she's not. Yeah, she's like, a week I old. literally had to think about it. I was like, no way is she a week old. She's a week old, and it's been the best week of our lives. It's been really good. She's a good kid. <laughs> she's such a good baby. I'm like, how did we get so lucky? All she does is sleep and eat. And then just like stare into my eyes and all we do is cuddle so the past week has been really nice literally just been having like skin on skin contact and no makeup days pajamas all day like obviously we haven't been vlogging all week so it's just been such a laid-back chill just amazing week it's been so good but um today is our first outing with both of the girls it feels so weird it to does have, feel like, weird having in the car it feels weird having Zoe in the car, period. I'm so paranoid driving. I'm, I'm so paranoid. I have to turn around every three seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she sees me. <laughs> you've been such a rock star. I, I know you haven't recovered completely, but you've just been amazing. Like, you're like Superwoman. What's feel, going on? I feel amazing. I feel so, like, different to Ava. Ava, I was just, like, struggleville for, like, months. But now I'm, like, I feel like good and I guess a part of that is because my labor was so good and also um, the fact that I didn't tear and I didn't have to get any stitches that's been amazing not having to deal with that pain you've been really good been keeping Ava occupied they're like extra besties now. like they were besties before but now they're just like she Next has time. actually become a real daddy's girl since the baby Mate, came she along. was a bad daddy's girl before the baby she came wasn't she as was soon as I got girl. pregnant no as soon as I got pregnant and I couldn't really like play with her the way you play with her she's definitely got like started to become a um, daddy's girl but that's okay I've got my so I can cuddle all day while you're playing she really is yours it's so funny Ava said to me yesterday she's like daddy not have a baby daddy needs a baby too and I'm like, I do have a baby. The baby's mummy and daddy's. And she's like, not your baby. It's mummy's baby. <laughs> Pretty much. So funny. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, so Ava has this new thing. Whenever you talk about her, she always says, I'm here. You don't like people talking about you, do you, Ava? Especially when she's around. You guys might remember this place. We came here with Ava. Didn't we, Avi? Ava got so excited because when we walked in here, she saw this on the wall and she's like, Mommy, that's me! Ava, where are you? Are you on the wall? Yeah, it's you! I see in you my mother's eyes and I lay your head to my shoulder Yeah. 
so funny. She's saying bye to everybody, like they're leaving and she's staying. No. Ava, do you want to go home? No. You just want to stay here forever and ever? Do you want to babysit her a few days? I can take her. <laughs> you can stay here. You want to stay here? You can live with me. You want to have a sleep over here? I've got a bed for you. <laughs> Clearly somebody loves Kristen. Seriously guys, if you need a baby photographer, this is your person. We can't recommend her highly enough. You can come anytime, Ava. You would not believe she was in a grumpy mood before she got here and now she's just been having a blast. What about you, Zoe? Are you ready to go? You did really, really well. You she pretty much just well. slept through the whole thing. Oh, Oops, you got startled. Sorry, sweetie. Sorry, Zoe. I swear Ava had that exact same onesie. No, this is a new one. Oh, is it? There's fussier eaters than me out there. I watched this BuzzFeed video the other day. Is it the guy that eats fruit for yeah. the first time? Mm, I watched that the other day as well. Do you reckon that's real? I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. How can you go your whole life without eating any fruit? Maybe he's got like a phobia of it. Well, he seemed to have, yeah. I had a friend who tried pizza for the first time in his 20s. And I mean, liked you it. You tried like steak for the first time. No, I didn't try steak for the first time in my 20s. I tried good steak for the first time in my 20s. I had only ever had well done steak and well done steak tastes like crap, it's chewy, it has no flavor. And then I tasted proper steak in my 20s and was like, wow, what am I be missing out on? Think about, yeah. Look at your long fingers. Look at your long fingers. You say hi to mama? You say hi to mama? <laughs> Hello. Hello, you little cutie. I love your cheeks. They're so cute. So I've just come to bed for a little bit. Um, we're about to have dinner, but I just wanted to lay down because Okay, so when I first got home from the hospital, I felt amazing. You know, down there, everywhere, I felt fine. And I think I just overdid it. I got too confident. I went, like, shopping and did a bunch of things that I shouldn't have done. Because so I was like, I feel okay. Um, obviously, I wasn't, like, gone all day. It was just, like, a 30-minute trip or whatever. But still, you know, I should have been resting. And so, yeah, it's catching up to me now. My bleeding's back. And, um... Aren't you just so cute? Oh, she's so cute, you guys. Look at her face. Oh, look at your sweet face. You ready for another feed, little bigly wig? You feed a lot, don't you? You're such a piggly wig. Not like your sister. How cool are these sneakers? My friend Hal had them custom made. This is genuine Louis Vuitton leather on the Nike tick. How cool are they? Thanks, mum. This looks really good. You know what's good when Ava's sitting over here, idiot. <laughs> Hi, Ava. Oh, she's like, I've been caught out. I've been caught on camera eating. Let's not let them know that I'm not a fussy eater after all. Oh. <laughs> I straight up jinxed it. Sorry, guys. It's my baby. It's not your baby. It is my baby. It's that mummy's baby. It's my baby and it's, mummy's baby. It's mummy's baby. Baby, it's me and daddy's baby. And you're me and daddy's baby, too. Daddy, 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 daddy. My baby. You're my baby. I love you. My baby. Yes, I do. Mommy, I love you. 
She's literally trying to make you jealous as well. I love mommy. I love mommy. She's trying to make you jealous. My baby, I love you. I love my baby. I love you. I love Ava. I love Amy. <laughs> Movie. You know what's even better than a movie? A dream, because it feels like you're in the movie. <gasps> chocolate eggs. <laughs> yeah, you can dream about chocolate eggs. <laughs> Do you want to go dream about a movie? No. She's smiling now. I was about to tell you a frog. See you a bit, Daddy. What? What? <laughs> I have no idea what you just said. She said, Abracadabra, I'm going to turn you into a frog so a bit. Uh, ribbit, ribbit. So the one challenging thing is we don't get to sleep when the baby sleeps like we did with Ava when she was a newborn and she would go to sleep and we would go and have a nap. Oh yeah, day nap. I could really use a nap right now. It's eight o'clock and we were just sitting in bed and we're like okay it's time to go and put Ava to bed and we looked at the time it's like eight o'clock we thought it was I legitimately thought it was about 10 or 11 right but no this one is out for the count she is so sleepy and this one over here is not sleepy at all Oh, time to sleep oh look at Zoe Ava look at Zoe she's just everybody's sleeping, sleeping. It's always it's always proving me wrong. She's opening her eyes. She's cheeky like Ava. <laughs> Ava's like, yes, she's on my team. I have trained you well, little sister. All in all, things have been pretty good with the new baby, haven't they? She's been perfect. She has. You've been the perfect baby. She's got the hat on. Does she, Ava? She's got the hat on. Oh, I like her hat. It's very nice. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna try and get Ava to go to sleep and then we're gonna try and get some sleep So thanks for hanging out with us today. If you'd like the vlog hit the thumbs up subscribe Hit the notification bell because if you don't hit the bell then you don't get a notification and we would love you guys to be notified And yeah, that's it. Can you say bye Ava? Bye vloggy. Oh, Zoe, she's like, bye vloggy <laughs> What did she say? Hey. She said bye vloggy <laughs>